It was an image seen around the world. In May of 2011, paramedics found Kevin McLean terminally ill, homeless, and living in his car in a Cedar Rapids parking lot. Alongside him, a loyal companion, a dog named Yurt. The paramedic who would ultimately move McLean to hospice and bring his loyal companion back to his rightful place beside him for his last days became our CBS2 hero Jan Ersig. There's not a day go by that I don't think of her dad, Kevin McLean, and uh, she's a constant reminder of him. Three years later, Jan's commitment to McLean and to now 12-year-old Yurti is stronger than ever. Uh -huh. that right? Last August, Yurti was diagnosed with cancer. She had some tough days, including multiple rounds of chemotherapy at the University of Wisconsin. And so far, so good. At last report, Yurt is cancer-free. But her trials were just beginning. The first time I met Yurti was when um, she was initially diagnosed with renal failure. That was February. As Dr. Streeter here can tell you, there's not a whole lot of options when a dog is in kidney failure. We've gone from one big medical condition that I thought had been taken care of, which the cancer has been resolved, um, into something that is more difficult difficult to treat. Difficult, but not impossible. I started to look into options for Yurt because she and I have a never give up attitude. That attitude led them to New York City and to very experimental stem cell infusions. Because of Yurti, Dr. Elizabeth Streeter from the Eastern Iowa Veterinary Specialty Center in Cedar Rapids trained to perform the therapy here at home. Yurti is really, I think, an inspiration to a lot of us, and especially Jan. I think the things that she's done for her um, and the changes that she's brought about in Yurti are really um, magical. <laughs> the prognosis is cautiously optimistic, and feeling better, Yurti finds herself again in the spotlight, this time as a pioneer for stem cell therapy. And in Jan and in Dr. Streeter's minds, Yurt, the real hero in this story. Yurdy was always the hero. I'm along for the ride with her. She brings a spirit and a life and a story with her that really is, is hard to describe and compare to.